Hey, good evening. My name is Jay Alexander. Um, I'm a event instructor and owner at Alexander's Martial Arts. This is my daughter, Claire. She and I run the online program. So typically you'll see one of us teaching their class and the other one's voice will hear over the, over the monitor, just giving encouragement and maybe correction or direction to the students as we move forward. Um, very impressed with what I've seen this last quarter. You guys have been working very, very hard and uh, have accomplished quite a bit. We're super excited to give you guys a little bit of a preview of what's coming up so that you can be excited about your upcoming quarter. Um, Claire, would you say anything? We've done some pretty complicated stuff this rotation, and you guys have done a really good job of it. So great work this time. I'm super proud of your work over the past three months, and congratulations. All right, congratulations, everybody. Good job. Congratulations. Um, overview of what's going to happen next, you're going to see a little bit of a tribute to the students who have just graduated, an opportunity to um, to celebrate their progress, and then after that, we'll show you a little bit of the curriculum that you're going to see for the next quarter. That we're going to be going over for each individual group, and then um, we'll get right into doing some of that, so you can get a good taste of what's coming up. All right, thank you very much. Enjoy the video, real quick. We're going to bow out and then leave the video for you guys to watch for a second. Thanks. Foot, good. Four, back, punch, front, returning. Put it back where it came from. And five, back, punch, front. Nice, reset, punch. Now we're starting with the right, ready? Go, back, punch, front. Put it back where it came from. Go. Nice chamber, Zoe. Go. Go. Nice work, slide back and retrieve your space. Start advancing, ready? And one, back, punch, front, advancing. And two, back, punch, front, advancing. And slide back, nice. reset, one. look to the left. Ready, position. One from the back. And one, grab, two, stomp, three, up and down as you turn. And four, knee, AR. Nice, all right, reset. Go, one from the back, grab, stomp, turn, AR.
or I'm going to size Brad in the hair. So I would grab her hair to move her head off her shoulders, right, to change her balance. Or I might be grabbing her hair to hold her while I hit her. So regardless, she's immediately going to go into action. So she's going to go from there. Boom, right. And put me to the floor. Nice. All right, so there's four from the side. And we'll break down and teach that. But I want you to see what that looks like. And then four from the back is a defense against a distance choke. People have a tendency to, uh, to grab you around the throat for a couple of reasons. Um, one, by grabbing high from the center, or, or high up, I'm a, a good way from her center, so I can change her balance quite a bit. Two, if I squeeze her throat, she can't go for help too good. And then three, of course, you suffocate if you don't get hair. So that's a fairly common attack, front or back. And four from the back, she's just gonna do a real quick um, defense to get away from that. You ready? All right. <laughs> Good job. All right, thank you, man. Nice work. And like I said, we'll break down and teach that um, coming right up. All right, so now that you guys have seen the curriculum that the students started in this last quarter, and you've seen a preview of what they're going to do for our next quarter, let's go ahead and do the most important part of tonight, which is um, let everybody know how proud you are of the progress and awarding the belts. So for starters, I would like the parents and the support team to let the students know how proud you are of their hard work, and then immediately, I'd like students to let the parents and the support team know how much you appreciate their support. Right? Because it's always um, a, a team effort to move from belt to belt. If it, even if you're just making sure they've got a good place to train and making sure that they're logged in appropriately and that everything's working well so that they can actually do their work, that is a huge, huge help. And then, of course, um, I see a lot of parents and um, support people, parents, grandparents, et cetera, brothers and sisters, jump in to be assistants to learn some self-defense pieces and parts, and we really appreciate that. Nobody gets a black belt by themselves, right? It's always going to be a student teacher or, or other students in class who help you learn and grow. So take a minute, let each other know how proud you are and how thankful you are for all the support. And then what I'm going to do is show you how to tie the belt. So Ms. Claire is going to loosen her belt up, I can show you how to do it as the parent or somebody awarding the belt. Okay, see so how she took it off and folded it in half. So I'm going to start from it being folded in half. Right? And then I'm going to take the stripe side and I'll lay that down on her left hip and then I'm going to wrap it around her back. So the unstriped side comes around on the right and I'm going to wrap it around two times. And then I'm going to go over both pieces and then reach back under both pieces so that I've tied the two circles of the belt around one another so they don't slip or change uh, circumference. And I'm going to take the piece of the stripes and cross it over, take the other piece, lay it over the top, and I'm going to stick it back through the little loop there. So the cloth is laying flat on itself, push it back through, start my tie, and then I'm going to get a nice sharp pop so that it cinches that knot in and stays nice and tight. So that's time in your belt. I'm going to do it one more time just to make sure that parents get a chance to, uh, to do that rather than just watch it. All right, so we fold it in half. We're going to start from the left, wrap around two times. So behind the back, around the front once and twice. And the piece that's coming through from the student's right is going to go over and under both. Then that same piece is going to go over and through the center of the knot. And then we'll just pull that knot in place and handshake, bow, congratulations. And that's what we're going to know, right? Anything you'd like to say to the, the students for their support crew? Congratulations, everybody. Thanks for the hard work and engagement these past three months. And thank you to everybody who helps make the online experience really complete. It can be a little bit confusing directions, especially. And so it really helps to just have someone there occasionally to just point out little things that help the kids understand what's going on a whole lot better. So thank you to everybody who's been helping out and congratulations on your work this past rotation. All right, guys, one last big round of applause to everybody that uh, tested and everybody to help them get to where they're at. All right, so we're going to go ahead and uh, bow out of this section and get right into the live part of class and start teaching some of your current curriculum. Okay. So real quick, thank you very much, and uh, we'll see you live. Works there.